Because your car always break down. Oh, your Lego one. So here's how to make a Lego smart car. It's Lego products. Um, C for Lego products. One. Oh, whatever my username is. Who cares about it? I am using my red pen again. So it is not necessarily good in graphics. So, let me show you how to make one. You get one of these small Lego bases, um, one by three middle, I mean four by three middle, of these. And then um, you're gonna get two two by twos and put them on each end like that. So it looks like that. Now you're gonna use a one by three and put it over here so it looks like that. You use another one and you put it over there. So now you want to get one of these wheel supporters. So make sure there's enough room for your tire to go there. And you put it right over here. Like that. Now you can use any of these colors because I got this from a set. And you put it over here so there's a scene. So get two one by twos, any color. Uh, I don't know why this set used green, but oh well. And you could get any type of steering wheel you want. Maybe no steering wheel if you want it. And you put it right in the middle. Make sure it's in the front. Or because if you have other colors, and you're using white, then put it in a white section. Now you want to take another one by two, any color. I don't recommend using green, and you put it in the front, right where the steering wheel is, and you get one of these computer uh, pieces. It looks like a mini sofa, and you put it at the end. Make sure it's facing the steering wheel like that. Then get two of these hinge with hinge panels two by four and one by twos on top and you put them like that so you put them like that it looks like that and you take another one and put it over here make sure it's like covering the green part so you don't see it. Now you're gonna get a one by four and right where you see the hinge panels, put it right before it. So it's not a big gap anymore. Now you want another one by two green, and as I said, I don't recommend all the green pieces in here. And you take a 1x2 vent radiator. I recommend grey. And then you want these small little slope pieces, one by one, and put each end over here, right next to the radiator. If your radio is uh, poking up too much, then maybe you want to press it down. Make sure these fit on top so it's like a skateboard. So that makes the front bumper. If you have any little pieces or you want to write a license plate and fold this up, doesn't matter. Uh, whoops, actually, I did the wrong thing. Use a 1x2 uh, flat. So you put it on. Now you can put your license plate and all that. Then you put the video right on top of it. Whoops. Now you want to get 1x1 um, one one studs any color 
transparent uh, ones are the best. If you want to use white, you can use yellow, whatever you want. Um, now you want to put this one by, I mean two by four, on top of uh, the two, the front pieces over here. Secure them. Then you take these dolls. If you don't have any, just take another one by three and put each on top of the uh, one by threes over here. And these are also one by three in size. So, so it looks like that. Make sure that the dolls can swing open and make sure the handles are facing out. You take one ball, put it on the opposite side. So it looks like that. Then you get use uh, an extra long windshield about I think it's a one by four. No, it's a four by three. So they stretch like long and it's not that high. And you put it from over here and make sure it closes in on the doors. If it doesn't, it has to be either shorter or longer. Now you want to take uh, any pieces. They use a uh, two by one transparent red or translucent red um, because it's like when the car is stopping, it's gonna light up, right? And put it right on top of these roof canopies. Four by four. And then you're gonna take some of these, two of them, in color. Make sure it matches the smart color. And it's about, let's see, it's about uh, two Lego bricks in length. So it's a one by two with one stubbed on top. So when you put on the back over here, the black part, they have to be facing out. And they have to be level with the windshield. If not, they're either too high or too low. Then um, you put this um, the canopy over, so you have some room. There was a luggage that came with this, but I don't know where it went. Now let me just pop this out. Anyways, you get these tires. Make sure they're smooth with no grooves and pretty small, and make sure they fit here. As long as they fit inside here, it's alright. So you want to get four of them. I think one just fell. Yep, one just fell. These could break really easily. And they're really easy to take apart. So it's fun. So you want to take four of the tires, make sure they're all nice and smooth. There. So make sure the doors can open. The roof could open easily. And you got a little car. It's not car at least. So now the little guy wouldn't have to worry. About having a broken car. Oh well, maybe it will. Who cares? Make sure to subscribe.